Hey Troopers, today we're going to take a look at one of our Star Wars parodies, which is a mashup of Star Wars Rogue One and some other Star Wars movies, so see if you can check out which movies we're parodying in which scenes. And then afterwards, we're going to be joined by two actors in the sketch, David Lautman and Steve Saunders, and we're going to talk about the behind the scenes of shooting this sketch. Stay tuned. Your father is critical to the development of a super weapon. If my father built this thing, we need to find him. A bug? Yes, Captain. Ketchup? Thank you. <laughs> what are you blind? The power we are dealing with is immeasurable, much more powerful than your ancient religion. You will give me a copy. Your mind tricks don't work on me. They only work on the weak-minded. Someone give me a copy! Misa Jar Jar Binks! Misa, your humble servant! Jar Jar, I need you to infiltrate the Rebel Alliance. Yes, sir, Massa Vader, sir. Are you sure that he's capable? Do not question my leadership. He is more than capable. Yes, sir. This copy tastes like... We need a ship and a pilot. Look, I ain't in this for your revolution. I expect to be well paid. I'm in it for the money. A dollar and 23 cents. That's all we have. Okay, I'll do it. But I'll need a co-pilot. Misa Jar Jar Binks. Misa, good pilot. <sighs> what? Don't everybody thank me at once. That's my ship, the Millennium Falcon. We must hurry. Who is this guy? He's my bodyguard. Oh, what good is a blind bodyguard? Oh. 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 One doesn't require sight when one can see with the Force. Oh yeah? Can you see this? Why are you hitting yourself? This guy might come in handy. I got one! Great, kid! Don't get vagina-y! Oh! There's another! That was one of ours! I told you not to get vagina-y! That was my bad! Oh! There's another! I was supposed to shoot that one. That one was okay. Chewy, you okay? You look awful. And there you have it. That's our Star Wars parody. Now we're being joined by David Lautman and Steve Saunders, two of the actors in the sketch. <laughs> Guys, what was it like shooting this sketch? It was a lot of fun. Um, I especially enjoyed working with Geo Lee on our little stunt sequence. I think we did it in like half speed. And then in post, I'm pretty sure Charles like sped it up so it looks like we knew what we were doing. And of course, part of editing that is also adding the sound effects too. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh. A couple of the other characters in there, I don't know if you guys watching at home caught it. Julie David was playing Jin Urso, but also we had another actress lined up to play another part in the sketch and she uh, no-showed that day. So Julie ended up having to play two parts in that sketch. So she was kind of having a scene where she was talking to herself. Juan Perez played Cassian Andor, who was another character from Rogue One, even though all of his scenes were with David, who was playing Han Solo, who was not in Rogue One, but was in all the other Star Wars movies. And then we also had to throw in, just for the sake of it, Jar Jar Binks, just so that we could show Jar Jar Binks getting killed. And Jar Jar Binks is in the prequels. He's not in Rogue One or the Han Solo movies. It was pretty much, it was a cool mashup, I would say, of interesting characters. And Julie, by the way, she the other character that she played was Mon Mothma. And uh, I thought that came out really well, especially now. I don't remember if we planned the catch-up bit. We planned the catch-up bit, but we knew we'd only get one take because then it was going to stay in her outfit. So we had to right. do it just one time. Yeah, it was. that was fun. Ketchup? Thank you. <laughs> what are you, blind? One of the other scenes that we spoofed in the movie is we took... Jin Erso, who was in Rogue One, and we put her in the cockpit in the Millennium Falcon from A New Hope, and her and Han Solo were having like that duel. I got 
Oh, one! Great, kid! Steve, anything else about your amazing acting in that scene with Scott Vogel? We were both on camera. Uh, we both had lines. <laughs> no, but uh, you know what I will say about Steve? Is, <laughs> is that his costume was awesome. Bath towels for the win, my friend. You were just wearing, it was a button-down dress shirt and a bath towel, right? And that was... Yeah. We needed to add a cape to it, but right. I didn't want to buy a cape, so we right. just put a bathrobe on it. Right. <laughs> it didn't stop me and be like, oh my god, that's a horrible costume. Like, it kind of, it works. I had to do some serious acting to make you believe that I didn't just step out of the shower. It worked, my guy. Thank you. All right, troopers. Well, we hope you like this video and enjoy this conversation with David and Steve Saunders. If you want to see more Star Wars parodies, I put a bunch of links in the description. You can click those and watch some of our other videos. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. See ya. Hasta la vista. La hitra out. That's Hebrew. <laughs> <laughs> we have saved the Jar Jar's life. Misa back. Why, Grenick? Why would you bring him back? <laughs> Misa can't breathe, sir. <laughs> Let us know what you want us to spoof next in the comments below. And as always, click subscribe. Okay. All right.